you cross the Nautilus with a polyamorous. <laughs> Give up. Sadomasochism. Because <laughs> the mon mo monogamist is bound to get hurt. And polyamorous is bound to hurt them. Create this piece as an improv in class. Call it Holly Sadist meets Monomasochist. Let's see what happens. <laughs> <laughs> talk about, mm. but, but not yet. Let me settle in first. Oh yeah, sure. Take your time. Hey, I have a surprise for you. I like the sound of that. <laughs> Check out my smooth, new Brazilian oh, wax. Oh god, you know how much I love that. Here, touch it. I want to do more than that. Oh yeah. <laughs> but, but not yet. Huh? We're gonna have to talk uh, first. Oh. Um, let me take a shower. I just got off the plane and uh, what am I thinking about? I should be fucking you right now. <laughs> okay, soon, soon, soon. <laughs> well, I could take a shower too. I've been cleaning all day. Okay, yeah, you would have loved the people that I met. Oh, yeah, they were just beautiful inside and out. Wow, can I get in there with you? <laughs> Especially this one couple. They oh, a just... couple? We talked about opening up and playing with a couple. Oh, yeah, yeah, and they're polyamorous and they live together for three years with another woman. All three of them, all together? How does that work? Are they committed? Well, they are opening the relationship up more now. In fact, she's going to be moving out soon. Oh, it didn't work, huh? No, no. It's, you know, they're just de-escalating the relationship. In fact, she's <laughs> the one that I had the deepest connection with. Oh. Really? <clears throat> yeah, yeah. We were in the Watsu pools, and we got a little bit too hot, and so we went up in the hills and found a place to sit. Did you have sex with her? Uh, well... We had a deep connection, and we went out on this point where they, we could look out over the whole valley. It sounds really beautiful. Yeah, yeah. Oh, you know, I wish you would have been there. It was We were cuddling under a blanket. Did and, you fuck her? Uh, <laughs> no, I don't like to use that word. Did you make love to her? <laughs> <laughs> yes, I did. And actually, I fell in love with her. She, You would have loved her, too. She was... This is lecture. such a surprise. I mean, I get well. I guess it shouldn't be. We talked about all the what ifs, and I don't want to put you in a box. No, I've been thinking about what it would be like to share with another woman. I want to support you in being who you are. Yeah, and you know, I really thank you for that. It's, you know, I I've, I've been, you know, wanting to. Uh, she's going to be coming down here. I want you to get a chance to meet her. So. Oh, this is a lot to take in. I mean, well, we have all these friends. Well, I guess they're mostly your friends that have these full lives with all these lovers. But that's so soon. Yeah, yeah, I totally hear you, and I want to support you. Let's go in the bedroom. Yeah, I could use some support right now. Yeah. You know, I, I just am amazed by our relationship. I love the way that we connect, and you know I wanted to make love with you right when I got home, and I want to make love with you right now, you know? Can we let our bodies reconnect? Right now, this is a lot to take in. Um, yeah, I want you to. I don't know. I want you to feel how much I love you. Well, there's part of me that really wants to, you know, give you whatever you want and and even be happy for you. But there's this other part of me that's just devastated. I mean, you just met her. How could you? Well, you said that you didn't want me to hold anything back. That you wanted me, you know, didn't want to withhold anything for your sake. That you wanted all the details. Well. The truth is, it was magical, and if you'd been there, you'd understand. I wasn't there, was I? <laughs> it doesn't change anything between us. In fact, you know, I really feel like I have more love for you. Yeah, I can feel it, but it's hard. Yeah, well, you know, I guess you're feeling, you're probably feeling resentment, fear? No, I'm pissed off. I mean, this total stranger. What, are you angry at her? 
I don't even know her. But how could you? Am I not enough for you? No, of course not. You're, you're, you're always saying no one person can ever meet all our needs. But how could you do this to me? Hey, nobody's going to take your place. You know, I love the way that you love me. You tell me my love is so special to you, but this is how you show it? Where's the evidence? I show you all the time. I got a Brazilian wax for you. Ah. That hurt. <laughs> Thank you for that. You know, I, I really do, but hey, I'm doing my personal growth work for us. <laughs> well, I'm doing my personal growth work for you. I'm not feeling loved by you right now. I hate to say it this way, but you know, you've got to take care of yourself first. You're right. And I just need to take care of myself right now. <coughs> I think I just need you to leave. Uh, I don't want you to see me like this. You just need to go. I hear you. I, I, I get that. What can I do? Just go. Um, I, I hear that you need some understanding. <laughs> no, I just need some space. Please, just go. Okay, I... I this is my apartment. <laughs> <laughs> you said that you'd support me in my process. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I'm gonna go down to the juice bar in the corner. Okay? Can you call me when you're when you're ready to talk? No, you call me. <laughs> will you will you pick up the phone? I don't know. <laughs> okay, all, all right. Bye. 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 I cleaned his apartment. I baked some cupcakes. <laughs> Deserve those cupcakes? I'm gonna eat them all right now.